All right, so I'm making another video, um, another winch video. My Harbor Freight winch lasted, um, I don't know, five seconds, maybe till like the end of the video, installation video. So I had to upgrade or at least replace, hopefully upgrade. This one's made by Zeke, Z-E-A-K, bought on Amazon for, I don't know, about 140 bucks, 3,500 pounds, nylon rope, and I got it hooked up, so I'm gonna try it out here. Right now I'm using the remote, the wireless remote, and then it's also got the um, mounted one up here, so I could go, I don't know which way is which here. In is down, and there we go. So I have a choice, you know, in case uh, the puddles are deep. <clears throat> um, but as of right now, since it hasn't broken yet, uh, compared to the Harbor Freight, I'm liking this one better. Again, this one's nylon, 3,500 pounds, made by Zeke, uh, Z-E-A-K. Had to make a couple of slight modifications to the um, to the box that it mounts in on the Polaris 450 HO, but uh, nothing crazy. Just had to uh, elongate the holes for this front uh, Zeke plate, which I had to do for the Harbor Freight one anyway, so it was no big deal. Uh, it was quite a pain getting the bolts in. On the bottom that hold it to the plate how to use a uh, set of grabbers but again uh it's working so uh, let's hope it works after uh you know when i'm stuck in the mud out in the middle of nowhere pretty sweet and there it goes thanks for joining my video and uh We'll catch you out there in the uh, wilderness.